I'm exposing Amazon's Photoshop fails and I've never been more excited. What is that? Cervical neck traction device and collarbone brace. Approved inflatable and adjustable neck support pillow, spine alignment, and chronic neck pain relief. I don't think that's relieving any pain. Let me tell you, her neck's not that long. Nope. <laughs> that is terrible Photoshop. That is, oh my god. They literally took a PNG of the product and just stuck it on the image. Like, that's not... That is not how it you wear it. That is not how it looks when it's actually on somebody's neck. But it was a good attempt. I appreciate the effort in the demonstration. Now, what kind of baby does that? What is that? What? Seven in one diaper bag backpack with changing station. Large capacity durable waterproof bag, honestly, I like the bag, like a foldable bassinet with mosquito net. That's, this is cool product. This is a cool product. They really could have went somewhere with this. I don't know if this is their attempt at being funny, but like, I feel like it just missed the mark a little bit. Like, I just want to see what it would be like with my baby actually in there. What is that? What is that? No baby is doing a one-handed plank. I can't even do that. Um, what happened to their heads? Christmas tree pajamas, matching sleepwear, cottons, kids PJ pants set. Why is it like that? Oh my God, if you zoom in on the dad in the photo, this is the worst Photoshop job I've probably seen. His face is photoshopped onto that hair. They really didn't even try to make this look good. <laughs> Zero effort. Oh my God. What is this? A keep warm strap, waist training workouts, more gym corset, plus size. Plus size. Not there, that's not plus size. What the heck are you talking about? The word waist training workout should not be mixed with sport gym and then corset. Y'all, please, for the love of God, please don't buy this. Please don't use these waist trainers, please. She doesn't look like that. They've done the cinching of the waist and it looks horrible. It looks absolutely horrific. I was gonna say, I can't believe that it got four and a half stars, but it literally has three customer reviews. So not totally surprising. The product seems as bad as the Photoshop. <laughs> oh, wow. Honestly, these just keep getting worse. This, this picture of this girl quite literally looks like it was done on PowerPoint. Like that's how bad the quality is. Or like when you're taking a very beginner Photoshop course and they have you like get rid of the background. That's what this looks like. It's terrible, it's terrible. Independent Trading Co. Women's Full Zip Hooded Sweatshirt. And like, they literally used that one picture and for all the different colors, just changed the color of the sweatshirt in the edited photo. Like if you're gonna like sell stuff as a business and charge someone $32, you better put an effort into your marketing and your website. Come on, give us anything realistic. Like, is that <laughs> Lord of mercy you're kidding you are kidding me what in God's green earth is that <sighs> what is happening it's just it's <sighs> they painted that they made this image on paint. If you remember that little application that was on desktops back in the day. That is what this is, that's what that is. The arms are real, but the dress isn't. But the purse is, the hair starts real and then as it reaches the dress, it gets painted. Oh, this is so, so bad. Every time we go through a different photo I'm like this is the worst photoshop I've ever seen and then another photo comes and then I'm like this is the worst photoshop these are all horrific 
maybe we should vote at the end for the worst, the worst one. This is just, you cannot sell that. It's, that should be illegal. You should not be able to sell a dress with that as the image. That's false advertisement, like quite literally. Oh my God, what is it with these family PJ sets? Like you can't just take a picture of any family wearing them and just post that. <laughs> like what? M Christmas family matching pajamas. Yeah, set for family. You know what? Multi-trust, I don't trust you. I don't trust you at all because of this photo. <laughs> the mom looks kind of realistic. I don't know what happened with dad over there. I don't know what happened there. There's just a lot happening here. Nothing's natural about it. No. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Oh, wow. Wow. Okay. Um. <laughs> I feel like they just stole this picture of a random person like on social media and like almost just put the dress on her or something or like she bought this dress and they just stole that picture and cropped everything else in the background and stuck it on there as like this is what our dress looks like <sighs> it's just not adding up nothing about it looks good absolutely nothing women's straps backless floral crochet lace body con cocktail party mini dress I don't think you need all those words. Also, straps. There's no straps. I don't see straps. Does it come with straps? You know what? No one's buying it. Doesn't matter. Oh, another cinching of the waist. Shock. Shocker. A nice blurred arm. Nice blurred waist, because you can always see when things are stretched and altered. You get that blurry effect. Yeah, great. Backless black dress, sexy sleeveless style, and you're only sexy if you have a tiny waist. Right. That was sarcasm, okay? So, God of mercy, please don't quote me on that. Like, sarcasm. If you're new here, you gotta get used to my humor. Sarcasm. What? What are we? It looks like a shark took a bite out of her. That is literally what this looks like. What? Please tell me this is not real. Please tell me. Tell me. <laughs> tell me. Skinny girl. Oh, skinny girl. Women's lace galoon lined with power mesh unstructured shaping cami. Pink? Where is pink? Oh, there's so much wrong with this. Not only is the shark bite enough to just pull your attention, but her head and neck are missing. They literally took the erasing tool and just got rid of half of her upper body, took a bite out of her side, because they're like, oh, we're a skinny girl, and she's not skinny enough, so let's delete half her body. But if you look at the arm, the erase, they erased a line and either forgot or they did that to make her arm look slimmer, but then they didn't complete it because you still see some of her skin there. Y'all, I'm feeling this is gonna be in the top three for the worst at the end. Oh yeah, that's bad. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. You gotta zoom in here a little to get the full effect. We gotta, you see the waist happening. You see it because you can see in her arm right here. It's all choppy and blurred. They obviously altered her body. And honestly, like the head, the head doesn't even match the body. It looks like they just like stuck her face on this body that they altered. It's very strange. It's just very, very strange. Steampunk gothic fet finish. Boned, top boned corset, lingerie. Oh, Y'all, what is with all the description words? Like less is more. All right, guys, it's time for our votes. I love this video. I could just, I could honestly look at Amazon like Photoshop fails all day. All day. A lot of them are bad. 
ones that stand out, the pink dress that they quite literally just painted. But I'm going to have to go with the shark bite. The shark bite is taking my vote for the worst Amazon Photoshop fail. Let me know your votes in the comments, you guys. And leave a like if you enjoyed this. I could do a part two if we had fun here. I can do a part two. This was fun. I'm having fun. Are you having fun? That's what I need to know. So let me know. I will see you guys in another video. Stay classy out there. Stay sassy. And uh, yeah, don't trust Amazon. <laughs>